Ruffman, humble media genius. This is where I answer your questions about media and technology. <clears throat> Abigator, age 10, asks, how much time do you spend on the computer? Well, thanks for writing in, Abigator. You know, it depends on what I'm doing. When I'm working on my computer, like, say, researching whether an Abigator is some sort of cool robot alligator, I might be on the computer for a few hours. But I also have fun on my computer. I play games, I watch videos. You just have to remember there's a ton of fun stuff to do away from the computer, too. You gotta get up and move a little bit. These tennis balls won't chase themselves, people. <laughs> Although they should. Good, age seven says, I like your hair so much. Aw, thanks, Good. I like it too. I find it gives me that handsome orange look that all internet celebrities try for. <laughs> no spray on tan here, boys and girls. Pure Ruffman. Haley, age 10, asks, is everything on the internet true? No, Haley, it is not. But this is true. Not everything on the internet is true. Wait, is there an echo in here? Blossom, tweak my mic. Libby, age 9, asks, how does a computer work? Please answer in kid language. Kid language, huh, Libby? Uh, well, you see, it's, it's totally like a thing. Like with wow and like, yeah, like computers, you know, it's like, OMG, like, how did you see Kyle's hair today at lunch? And that thing he did with that cheese was like, it was cray cray. And like, <clears throat> next. Mary Ann, age nine, asks, what is a virus? Well, this is a great question, Mary Ann. A virus on a computer is a little computer program. Just a bunch of words and numbers, really. That can totally mess up your computer. It can move from one computer to another in email, or when you go from one website to another. So it's called a virus because it can spread like germs spread from person to person. You can put special software on your computer to try to protect it, but your best bet is for you to learn how to safely use email and the internet. Kylie Ann, age 12, asks, do you think kids my age should be allowed to have a phone or use technology during a school night? Oh. <laughs> All right, well, Kylie Ann, even Ruff Ruffman, humble media genius, can't answer this one. This type of question can only be answered by you and your family. <laughs> yeah, I'm best I bow out of this one. <laughs> bow out. <laughs> That's hilarious. <laughs> bow out. <laughs> I'm funny. That's all we have time for today. I'll see you next time. Now I want a sandwich.